At the Kennedy Satcher Center, we aim to give voice to the many ways behavioral health touches healthcare and how we can bridge access to care by leveraging creative partnerships and promoting wellness as a whole pathway to vulnerable people. Mental health equity is health equity because in so many communities that have been historically deprived of comprehensive resources, mental wellness is survival. It is a pathway to success and longevity. Mental health equity is important to me and to the 37,400 psychiatrist members of the APA because we truly have a healthy society only if all people have fair and affordable access to health care. Mental health equity is important to me because mental health challenges disproportionately affect Black and other women of color. For moms and birthing people, mental health, along with perinatal health inequities, has been fueled by systemic racism. Both in my role as APA CEO and personally as a psychologist, I feel strongly that mental health equity is health equity. This is because our mental health is inextricably tied to our physical health. We know that certain communities have disproportionate vulnerability to experiencing adverse social determinants of health, and that these factors then lead to physical and mental health disparities. My patients were denied necessary care because our health system is unable to meet their needs. The fight for mental health equity is critical to the fight for health equity. Mental health equity is health equity because we do not accept an approach of treating the body alone we care for all aspects of a veteran's life.